Hello, hello, people. Good evening. Welcome one more time to our English class with English Corporativo. Okay. Okay, hello, people. Are you there? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, hello. Yes, sir. Good so, we have Byron, Edgar, Jocelyn, Diana, Giovanni, Marvin, and Elvin. Okay, I have this activity tonight to start to warm up, and it's about adjectives and their opposites. Okay, so you're going to see a picture and an adjective, and you have to give me the opposite of that adjective. For example, we might say fast. What is the opposite of fast? Slow. 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 Aha, uh -huh. okay. Slow. So that Slow. is this activity about. Okay? Okay, sir. So we have one, two, three, <laughs> four, five, six, seven only. Okay, one group is Byron, Edgar, and Diana. It's team one. You're gonna be team one, Byron, Edgar, and Diana. And team two are Giovanni, Jocelyn, Marvin, and Elwin. Oh, we have more now. Oh, no, I think we can do it boys versus girls again. Now we have four girls, Alexandra, Sandra, Jocelyn, and Diana. Yeah, let's, let's do it boys versus girls one more time, okay? So ladies first. Okay. 
ladies okay. first. So ladies are team one. Okay. 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 Uh, 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 um. Ladies are team one. So you begin. Ready, ladies? So remember, yeah. you have to give me the opposite. What is the opposite for heavy? The Light. What? Light. Right. Let's check. Correct. Okay. Points for girls. 25 points for girls. Okay, team two. What is the opposite for fast? Oh my. Slow. 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 <laughs> yeah. Slow. Okay. Good. Okay, team one, girls. What is the opposite for dirty? Dirty. Clean. 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 Okay, good. 40 to 15. Team two, your turn. What is the opposite for thin? Fat. 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 Okay, Fat. Fat. correct. Now the score is 25 to 40. Hey, why? I don't because know. you go you you give more points the girl. No, it's not me. <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> it's a website. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Always we're gonna we're gonna win. <laughs> okay, now number five is for team one, girls. What is the opposite for empty? Full. Full. Okay. Good. Team two, boys. The opposite for cold. It's very easy. Cold. Cold. Cool. Hot. 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 It's hot. 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 Ah, hot. yes. Hot. Okay, good. Team one, girls, the opposite for good. Bad. 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 Very Bad. easy. <laughs> okay, team two, and look at the okay. score, 70 to 30. My. Okay, boys, what's the opposite for serious? Pop. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> happy, happy, uh, maybe happy, serious, or funny, funny, funny? yeah, yes, yeah, maybe funny, maybe funny, 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 uh, funny. Yeah. yes, funny, okay, <laughs> team one, what's the opposite for wet? Dry. Bye. 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 Five. 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 No, dry. Ah, okay, dry. No, I listen. No, I. <laughs> okay, good. Too easy. Boys. Ow, oh, come on. The opposite for bad. Good. 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 Okay. Okay. Look at the score. Hey, what's wrong with this? Hey. Y a quién le dieron los puntos? Parece las elecciones de volar. Es truco. Okay. Girls, the opposite for difficult. Uh huh, girls. Easy. Easy. Easy, yes, okay. Team two. Boys, the opposite for ugly. Uh -huh. huh? Pretty, 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 or beautiful? Pretty, 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 
Brady. Brady or Brody. Brady. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Beautiful. Oops. <laughs> My <laughs> <laughs> Okay, girls. The opposite for sweet. Huh. Interesting. Sour. Sour. Good. Very good. Okay, boys. The opposite for hot. Ah, very easy. Cold. 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 And girls, opposite for happy. Sad. Sad. Okay. Boys are going to be sad. Okay, boys. Finally, the opposite for straight. Curly. Curly. Oh, okay. Curly. Okay, and the winner is team number one with 130 points. <laughs> okay, very good. Congratulations, girls. Thank you. Good job, teacher. Good job, good job, yes. Okay. Well, let's get it started now. Last class. We finish with. Hey, what do you. Okay, we have a conversation to practice. So watch the video and pay attention to this conversation, please. I'm going to mute your microphones for a moment in order to listen to this conversation. See if I'm sharing the sound, yes. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation where wood for invitations is used when making plans. We will learn through this conversation how to accept or refuse an invitation. As you listen to the audio program, pay attention to expressions such as I'd like to and I love to. An invitation. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I'd love to. What time does it start? At 8 o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at 6? Uh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay. Let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Very short. Okay. Okay, here it is. Here we have the conversation. Please turn on your microphones and we are going to practice the conversation. Okay? Okay. So listen and repeat after me, please. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? I have, I have tickets, tickets to the soccer, soccer, match, soccer on match on Friday, Friday night. night. Would you like to go? 
said, thanks, I'd love to. What time does it start? Thanks, i love to. What time does it start? At eight o'clock. At eight o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? That's, That's so great. great. Do you want to have want dinner, to at dinner at yeah. six o'clock? Oh, I like to, but I have to work late. Oh, I like to, I like to, to, to work late. To work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Oh, that's okay. Let's okay. 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 just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. Okay. Let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay. okay. Now I am Dave and you are Susan. Okay? Okay. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. Hey. I love to. I love to. Love to. Well, love to. That's the at eight o'clock. That sounds great. Oh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That's on See you there. Okay, good. Now you are Dave and I am Susan. You begin one, two, three. I have had a Thanks, I'd love to. What time does it start? At, at uh, eight o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? Oh, oh, oh I like to, but I have to work late. But I have to, to, to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet. Okay, let me at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay. That sounds fine. Any question with the conversation? No. 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 Okay, very good. So, uh, I am going to send you to small groups. I want you to practice the conversation one more time at least two times, changing roles. And then I have some statements to respond to or false according to the conversation, okay? I will give you five minutes to work on that, practice the conversation and check these statements, true or false. And then we'll come back together and we'll check your work. You have this in WhatsApp already. Okay, okay. it's uh, six, seven groups. So join the groups, practice the conversation, and respond to statements true or false. And see you in seven minutes. ¿Qué pasa? Yeah.
Okay, welcome back. So let's check your work. The first they, statement says they, they have stick they well, they has tickets for the soccer match. Is that true or false? True. It's true. It's true. true. Okay. Yes. Next, the soccer match is on Thursday evening. False. 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 Because, because the soccer match is, is on Friday, Friday. Friday night. Friday night. It's on Friday night. Next, the match starts at 8 p.m. Is true? True. For me, it's true. 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 Okay. They are going to have dinner at six. False. 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 Why? Because they have to work late. They have to work late. Okay, good. Next, they has to work late, late on Friday. It's true. true. That's true. That's true. And finally, they are going for dinner at 7.30. False. 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 the match. At the gate. False. 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 Very good. Any question? No. Question. No questions. Perfect. Well, we have another video to watch related to the grammar. So let me play the video to study how to use would plus verb. Okay. So, watch the video and we're going to talk later. I'd really like to go. Would you like to go to a soccer match? I'd like to. At the end of this lesson, participants will comprehend the use of word in questions and answers. Remember I told you last class to pay attention to the conversation when they used I like to or I love to? Well now it's our turn to study how to form a sentence for accepting and refusing an invitation. Let's check it out. Would. Verb plus to plus verb. Would you like to go out on Friday? Yes, I would. Yes, I'd love to. Thanks. Yes, I'd really like to go. Would you like to go to a soccer match? I'd like to, but I have to work late. I'd like to, 
But I need to save money. I'd like to, but I want to visit my parents. Contraction. I'd equals I would. In order to accept an invitation, we need to follow the structure. Subject plus word plus verb plus to plus verb plus complement. Examples. I would like to go to her new house. I would love to go to her new house. And when we need to refuse an invitation, we need to follow this structure. Subject plus word plus verb plus to plus verb comma but plus examples I would love to go to her new house but I can't I would like to go to her new house but I can't Let's take a look to this grammar, okay? So, we have the invitation in this form. Would you like to go out on Friday? Or would you like to go to a soccer match? So you are extending an invitation to someone or somebody is inviting you. And when you accept the invitation, so you can respond in these ways. Yes, I would. Yes, I'd love to. Yes, I'd really like to, to go. So different forms to respond accepting the invitation but when you are going to refuse or to decline the invitation you can respond these ways okay i like to but i have to work late i like to but i need to save money i'd like to but i want to visit my parents Okay, and remember that I'd is the contraction for I would, I would. Okay, let's practice this. Turn on your microphones, please, and let's practice these questions and responses. First, repeat after me. Would you like to go out on Friday? Would you like, would you like, to, like to go out like on Friday? Yes, I would. Yes, I would. Yes, I would. Yes, I'd love to. Thanks. Yes, yes. yes. I'd love, love to. to. Thanks. Thanks. Yes, I'd really like to go. Yes, I'd I really, really like, like, to go. like to go. Okay, another invitation. Would you like to go to a soccer match? Would you like Would to, you go, to go, go to a soccer, soccer match? match? I like to, but I have to work late. I like to. Have to work late. work late. Have to work late. I'd like to, but I need to save money. I like to. I like to. I need to save money. To save money. I'd like to, but I want to visit my parents. I'd like, I'd like, like to, but I want to visit, visit my parents. parents. I'd like okay. to, but I want to visit my parents. Okay, any question here? No. Would, what are you speaking, Aria? Would, would is... Yeah just like an auxiliary here so uh is what gives the form for like so would you like to go this te gustaría it's a would okay okay makes that change in the verb okay okay would you like okay. to that's it 
things. I would like to. Me gustaría. I would go with you. Iría. I would eat chicken. Comería. So that's would. Now. I would not. Me encantaría. Maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Okay. Now you have this exercise there in WhatsApp. I have given you some invitations already. And I want you to write, let's uh, use your creativity, okay? I want you to write one answer, accepting the invitation, and another answer, declining, refusing the invitation. Like here, okay? The invitation is, would you like to go to the movies? Accepting the invitation? Yes, I would love to. Let's see a romantic movie. Okay? You can also use a contraction here, okay? I would, I'd. I'd. Or, what was that? Or declining the invitation? I'd love to, but I have to help my children with their homework. Okay? So you usually to be polite, to express good manners, when you decline an invitation, you give a reason why. Okay? You don't just say, oh, no, thanks. No, no. So it, it is polite, it is good to, to tell the other person why you are declining the invitation. So and so one way is this one form to say no, but in a very polite form. I love to, but I have to help my children with their homework. So you have four more invitations. Would you like to go to the park? Would you like to go for coffee? Would you like to go to the disco? Would you like to go to the beach? So imagine, use your imagination and write a an, uh, positive answer, accepting the invitation, and a negative answer, declining the invitation, okay? I'm gonna put you in small groups to do this. Okay. Any question with the activity? What time, teacher? What time uh, you I think activity? you can do it in what? Seven minutes? Okay. Good. The same groups. Claudia, I'm going to send Claudia here.
Okay, welcome back. Let's see what you what you got. Uh, let me start with um, Marcella. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna ask you, and you give me your responses. Okay. Okay. First, accepting the invitation. Okay. So first, we are going to practice okay. just accepting the invitation, okay? And then later, declining. Okay, uh, Marcella, would you like to go to the park? Yes, I would like to buy, buy ice cream. We oh. can buy ice cream. Ah, okay, excellent, very good. Okay, Marcella, ask another question to another student okay hey edwin okay you ask the would question would you like to okay would you like to go to the disco sorry Estoy buscando la imagen, permítame. Ok. Repeat, please. Would you like go to the disco? Accept or, or Accept. decline? Accept. Yes, I would love to. I, I like... Uh, Go to the disco to the dance. Okay, good. Continue, Edwin. Ask another question to a different to another student. Um, Edgar Perez. Okay. Hi. Would you like to go to the beach? Yes, yes, I love to go. I love to. Thanks. Okay. Continue. And, and another question for, for Marcela. Okay. Would you like to go for, for coffee? Uh, yes. I I would like coffee. We can go to the restaurant. Okay. Continue, Marcel. One more. Okay. Gabriel. Mm -hmm. 
and go would you like to go to the park Gabriel Hola 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 hoy sí Ajá uh -huh. okay. yes affirmative or decline affirmative. or accept affirmative yeah mm -hmm. I love to let's go to the park Okay Continue, and now let's practice uh, declining the invitation. Okay. Uh, uh, Edgar Perez. Mm -hmm. Hola. Edgar. Hi. Okay. I'm not. Este, uh, uh, would you like to go for coffee? For coffee? Yeah, uh, I I would like. Well, I don't drink coffee. Okay. Okay. Good. Continue, Edgar. Edgar. To Gabriel. Okay. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. To Sandra Diaz. Sandra, okay. Ask, invite Sandra. Would you like to go to the park? Yes, I like to go in the park. Okay, decline the invitation, Sandra. Decline. Say no. Decile que tenés novio. <laughs> Sandra, she wants to okay. go. <laughs> okay. She is Alexandra. Okay. Hola. We're now decline, okay, people, decline. Continue, Sandra. Okay. Would you like to do the disco? Alexandra. 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 Yes, I would love to go dancing. Repeat, please. Yes, I would love to go dancing. Okay, good, but I want to practice the uh, refusing the invitation. Okay. Okay. Now, ask one more, Alexandra, ask someone, someone else. Alexandra. As Carolina, Alexandra, ask uh, Carolina, invite Carolina. Me informa negativa ahora. Perdón, no le escuché. Invite Caroline. Ah, Caroline, would you like to go to the disco? I love to, but I will work late. Okay, good. And now, Caroline, invite Claudia. Okay. Would you like to go to the beach? No, say no. I'd love to, but I have English class in this moment. <laughs> <laughs> Good, good student. And Claudia, invite Marvin. Marvin, would you like to go to for coffee? No, say no, Marvin. I I like to, but I don't have money. <laughs> very honest, very honest. <laughs> Okay, Marvin, invite By Byron. Hi. 
Byron. Uh, would you like to go to the restaurant? Mm, accept or decline, teacher? Decline. Say no. Say no. Uh, I love to, but I can't because my, my teacher say me no. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, we have to stop here. Um, the last activity is a reading. So I think you can do it at home. And you have the reading in, in WhatsApp. It's an article about Christina Aguilera. And I have given you some statements to check true or false. So please do it at home and we will continue tomorrow with, with section five. Uh, remember to work in the platform, complete the exercises in the platform. Okay, because we finish, we're gonna finish this week, this module. Okay, any question? No, no, no question. No. Have a good night then. And see you tomorrow. See you Good tomorrow. night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Bye.